All right, thank you, Tony. And this morning's wintry uh, weather delayed the start of school for thousands of local families. And when Socket school was actually canceled this morning, but the cancellation had less to do with weather and more to do with teacher absences. Iowa News News reporter Kate Walsh joins us now live from the mobile newsroom. Kate. Mike and Shannon, in this case, students missed out because teachers called out. The superintendent told us there were 197 teacher and 24 TA call outs last night before he made the decision to cancel school for today. And he said to put that into perspective, in October, there were about 55 call outs per day on average. A stressful morning for parents of students in Moonsocket Public Schools. So not only am I shoveling snow, I had to find a babysitter and she has a dentist appointment. So <laughs> it's just a busy, busy Friday morning. Superintendent Dr. Patrick McGee had to cancel school for everyone, but not because of the city's seven inches of fast melting snow. In a letter posted on Facebook, Dr. McGee blamed it on a quote, excessive number of scheduled teacher and absences across the district, adding that he could not quote, cover all classes with substitute teachers. Teachers have been working without a contract and haven't come to an agreement with the city on a new one with a raise included. We spoke with Mayor Lisa Baldelli Hunt. I, it's very disappointing that the Woonsocket Teachers Guild, the union, are uh, uh, mandated that their teachers and paraprofessionals uh, call in sick and have a sick out. It's affecting, uh, that behavior has been affecting the students of this community. Our students deserve an education. The Woonsocket Teachers Guild responded with a statement that quoted its executive vice president, Roxanne Caria, saying, quote, I can only speculate on the reason why so many people have called out on this day, adding, quote, this year has been taxing for every public school teacher and paraprofessional in the city, continuing to say the lack of respect from the city could cause stress in the form of physical illness. They got The teachers got to do what they got to do. They deserve a raise too. They definitely do. They they put up with a lot with dealing with our kids. The mayor told me recently voters changed the city charter so that the school committee would be voted in and not appointed by the mayor and city council. So she said moving forward, the school committee, newly elected, will be the ones to negotiate with the union on their contract. I'm Kate Walsh, Eyewitness News.